Good evening guys, happy Friday to all of your sunshiny faces. Ugh, guys, <laughs> today feels like not as bad as yesterday. Feels different than yesterday, but um, like whereas yesterday I couldn't enjoy eating anything because my throat like was so everything burnt that I was eating and it just tasted, and it didn't help yesterday, I ate Chipotle for dinner, so it was very acidic anyway, and it just felt like everything was burning my throat yesterday. Um, today, like, my eyes feel really sore, and, like, I actually feel like I have, like, a cold or something. Like, I have no clue. <laughs> it's been the weirdest kind of, like, you know, again, sickness or, um, again, sinus infection or whatever it is that, like, I've ever had. I don't know. Like, I didn't, I had, like, four days of, like, pre-symptoms, and then all of a sudden feel sick. Um, the, I don't know, like I said, I don't really feel like sick. Like yesterday again too, it's the same thing, like I felt fine. Like today too, it's like I feel fine. Like mentally I feel more clogged just because I feel like my face feels clogged a lot worse than it has any of the other days. So anyways, um, <laughs> my dad though, um, he ran to Tony's and Caputo, so I'll share that with you guys. I did like get some little things done, like I did some uploading, I was gonna start editing, I ended up um, doing a little dishes and things like that, but again too, it's just like, I don't feel, like I, again, I don't really feel bad, like I don't really have like body aches or chills, like I don't have like a fever or anything like that. So, um, you know, but it just, I feel very off and on top of that too, it's all, I'm congested. So anyway, so let me share with you guys though what we ended up picking up from these two stores today. So right here on the table, this is what we ended up picking up from Tony's or my dad did. Um, looks like all the coupons came off, everything rang up at the right price. My dad actually went through self-checkout um, because he said he wasn't going to wait in line. They had like two lines open. I guess they were kind of full. So my dad was like, I was just getting a couple things. And he went through self-checkout. He was nervous though because he's like, I don't know how to like, you know, do the phone number, make sure the coupons come off, all that kind of stuff. Um, you know, doing the, the self-checkout. Thankfully, someone was there to help him. So he was able to get all these. And like I said, it looks like all the coupons came off. So... He ended up paying only $19.16 and saved $30.95. So alone, these items would have totaled about 50 bucks and we paid less than a half of that. Um, which I think is really awesome. So we paid about two fifths of that. <laughs> but um, anyways, like I was saying, really good deals. This was the freebie Friday. So this is Friday and Saturday you can get this. It is the Kids Cuisine Level Up, um, like the Dino Nuggets kind. Originally my dad couldn't find it, then he ended up finding it, which was awesome. Um, but for some reason, he said there was like other kinds. Now I don't know if they were the Level Up kind, which was the one that said it was like for the coupon. But the only one they showed in the app, like you can click on the coupon and then it'll show you like available products that match up with the coupon. The only kind was this Dino Nugget kind. So we got that, um, which like I said, was completely free. I think it's normally $4.99 or something like that, but it was completely free. That's an awesome freebie. I'm sure Jack will enjoy that. I honestly, growing up, cake cuisine was like my favorite thing ever. And it was something we didn't get very often. So like I said, I think that's pretty cool. Um, we got that for free. Then the Home Run In pizzas, these are on sale for $3.99 with the digital coupon. Um, they're limited to two, so we went ahead and picked up two of those. They also had the Pillsbury, um, like, canned frostings were on sale for $0.99 cents each. They were a limit of four. The only kind my dad said they had left, though, was the vanilla kind. They also had, I think, buttercream and, like, fudge chocolate or chocolate fudge, whatever. He said the only kind they had left, though, was vanilla. So you just went ahead and picked up some of those. Like, my mom just made a cake for, um what's it called uh like an impromptu kind of cake for halloween and ended up decorating it with like sprinkles and stuff like that but we ended up using one of the cans that we had in the pantry because we have like some extra like um boxed cakes mixes and stuff like that so if we're ever just like oh just like impromptu you know kind of like again halloween or something like that cake it's nice to have these on hand in the pantry so we went ahead and picked those up for 99 cents too that's a really awesome price because i think the dollar tree sells like the nine ounce sizes which is like half this for a dollar 25 so i thought that was a really good deal then they also had the avocados were on sale i believe it was a five pound bag for two dollars i think or they were like 20 cents each um but they were in a five pound like package so for only two bucks i thought that was really good for those and then also too the polish ham which was on sale for 4.99 a pound we got about a pound for 4.89 so that was everything from tony's like i said um under 20 bucks which i thought was awesome for these items that we ended up picking up 
but let me share with you guys Caputo. So everything from Caputo's, it was $10.40 and we saved $7.18, which again, too, is almost a 50% savings. And again, too, on produce items, that's a really good deal because a lot of times they don't have like the produce items retail at like that much of a higher cost than really what they put them on sale for sometimes, um, especially if they're like in season anyway. Like for example, right now, the um, apples, those are on sale for 69 cents a pound. We got a little under two and a half pounds for $1.59, but it says you only saved 23 cents on them. Which again, too, had I went and picked these up, even at like Walmart, it probably would have been more than $2 for, <laughs> you know, whatever this is, five apples, you know, almost two and a half pounds. They're probably like three, four dollars for a bag like that at like, again, Walmart or something like that. So again, too, the retail price of the item isn't always as high as like, you know, what they actually end up going on sale for like for that week or whatever so again that was still a really good deal but um again we didn't have like 50 percent savings on all of the items but like again that was just an example of sometimes those don't retail at that high of a cost during certain periods of the year as well like right now because it's fall it's apple season <laughs> so then bananas runs out for 49 cents a pound we got under three and a, or two and a half pounds for that was a dollar 15 and then the um, potatoes, the three pound bag of potatoes was on sale for 99 cents. And the celery, the organic celery was on sale for 99 cents for like a bunch or whatever. Um, so we picked that up and then the um, the cheese, that was on sale for three ninety nine a pound, got about three fourths a pound for two ninety five. dollars And the Eck Ridge Hard Salami, which was on sale for three ninety nine a pound as well, got a little over half a pound for two fifty five. dollars So we had two really good deals on those. We're under uh, 30 bucks between both stores, which I think was really awesome, especially considering too, like these pizzas alone will probably make one dinner um, for us, you know, um, on a night when <laughs> we're not cooking or something like that. Um, or I just need to use them up and get them out of the freezer because I honestly don't know how much freezer room we have right now. So those might be for dinner tomorrow or the older ones that are already in the freezer might make them for dinner tomorrow. But anyway, so that I need to share with you guys those deals that were going on, not too much. Um, and I think my dad also said too, I did have him, um, I put down on the list, there's three pound bag of onions for 99 cents, but he said they were out or like you can find them, whatever. Um, so that was the only other thing I think I was planning on or put down at Caputo's that we didn't end up getting, but everything else we were, I think he was able to find and we got and all that stuff. Which again too was really good deals at um, the both of those stores. So anyways, I'm going to get this stuff put away. I thought I'd just share that with you guys for today and what was going on at these two stores. Well guys, I'm going to take a shower and get to bed. Um, I'm sorry, today's vlog, possibly tomorrow's vlog. <laughs> Not going to be probably super long just because, again, it is difficult to talk, to breathe, to um, just kind of function like <laughs> jack was in the living room and he was like asking me questions while we were sitting there watching tv tonight and like he was saying things and i was just giving him a thumbs up i was like you know it's weird when i start talking it's like not bad but it's like that i don't want to start talking like you know right now like i'm finding everything like that it's just the i don't want to start the talking <laughs> and like then or just like say like two things and then like stop talking again it's like once i get the momentum it's good but i don't like um, you know, like I said, having to, <laughs> to start talking. Um, and the other thing that's funny is too, guys, I don't know, like, I'm almost wondering if maybe I had something else, like, from on last Saturday when I wasn't feeling good, and, um, like, today and yesterday I actually got sick because Jack and my dad both are not feeling good today. So I was like, I wonder if whatever we got, maybe we all got at the same time. Maybe it was like from the football game on Saturday, we all got sick at the football game. And maybe I had something else prior to that and it was like a sinus infection or it was like a cold or it was just allergies or something like that. And then now I'm actually sick. <laughs> so I have no clue, but um, it's funny. If that's the case, I actually got through the entire football season without having, like, without being sick because last year and the year prior, both years, back to back, I got sick at the exact, I don't know if it was the exact same time, but it was the exact same school we played. Um, and I think I told you guys, there's this one school that we go to that um, there's two different schools that play at the same stadium. And last year and the year prior to that, 
we played like one of the teams there one year and then the other team like they're a different year or whatever both years back to back at the same stadium i was sick and it was funny because this year i was like it's the first time i even told my mom i was like it's the first time in two years that we've been here that i haven't been sick and so um it's funny too because i was thinking about that i was like i wonder if i'm going to get through next or the rest of the football season because this was like halfway i think the halfway point of the football season this last year and i was like i wonder if i'm going to get through the football season without getting sick because it always seems like i got sick like during the football season um like and i don't really get sick like i don't think again too in the last two years it's like i get sick once every year and it's normally at the same time it was at least for the last two years and i think you're like two years prior to that I hadn't gotten sick and it was just like again too like cold kind of thing or whatever this is and it was the same like the exact same thing right now too so that's why I was like it's funny that I probably would consider this actually being after the football season so it's the first year that I haven't actually been sick during the football season um and but it's right on the heels of it and I think that's kind of, that's kind of funny um but again too I felt like better than yesterday but again too it was like different symptoms than yesterday so like whereas yesterday my throat was bothering me so bad today it's like I just feel way more hoarse and like just like again too like I was saying my whole head and like right now my sinuses are hurting really bad so um I'm gonna take a shower and and like I said hopefully clear some stuff up with all the steam and then get to bed but I felt so much better last night after I took a shower and I was like I should have taken a shower earlier yesterday <laughs> so that I could feel better earlier but um yeah anyway so I will see you guys all in tomorrow's vlog if you guys did enjoy today's make sure you guys give the gold thumbs up if you guys are new we'd love if you'd subscribe and I'll see all of your sunshining faces tomorrow so bye guys